What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Jim Rapsua. <laughs> Just imagine waking up and get the body that you want you deserve. Can you imagine waking up every morning knowing you're doing exactly what you're doing, what you need to do, what you, what you are here to do, what you are put on earth to do, to do what you need to do, be disciplined about what you're doing, being that human being, cause something, cause something, consuming something that is responding to, that is not to, just to react, but to respond to in a positive way and balance equilibrium not everything or everyone in this world deserve your attention deserve your time deserve your energy deserve your present that's why you see me out here sometime even now i'm then <laughs> Be, being with nature because nature deserves the present of one and as we stay in our own lane stay in our own light be the love and light right <laughs> so what if I told you that uh, there's a simple and very effective ways to achieve the thing that you desire for without even cost you uh, it, won't, it, won't, it won't cost a thing. <laughs> so as we are here, we write out our own um, story. We write out our, our, uh, our dreams. We uh, touch and feel within our heart and the senses that are are within us and what is it that we are after the only way you have dreamt about to fruition is the dream as the Fruitarian, the spiritual thoughtful spirit speaking with the gratitude for every waking moment it's a spiritual speaking and it's something that you seek for something that you out of speak into reality you know what I mean so that's the dream that we all have and we wanted to have it to come to fruition as a fruitarians I just want to put the words together anyway so as, as we all have a choices to make either we want to give up or never give up it's the directions it's the leads to the new horizon it's the things that are happening now <laughs> right and I don't know that what to do about it it's the it's something I would say is an excuse that we don't know what to do about it because we always have something to do about it and sometimes it might take a little bit of sacrifice. In weeks to come, you will see some thing that's being covered within the critical question within yourself, for yourself, if you start to feel and listen for yourself because every week, every day, every month, there has to be some quality question you want to ask for yourself when we're starting out on our journey, uh, on our day, when we wake up upon our new beginning you know we have to get out and be in tune with yourself to be able to hear what what is it that necessarily when we pray for the answer as we are loving running and the business that we feel like to 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 embark on to create to co-create to make things better for our eco family because you know we're not always happy with the direction that we're in in the business or going into right so this is something that we also need to take for ourselves as we feel stuck sometimes every now and then you are not sure what to do right that's when we just take a time and take the time alone take the time go to the gym or come out of nature and do some of your cardio running and just let your mind just be at ease and be free and set yourself free irrevocably this is incredibly useful when we are able to to just not have so much thoughts in our mind when we need the answer because we may very well save the future of our business before we give up on it when we are here in nature because we have more time to think more time to unpack a load of shit that we may be carrying around all the thoughts and stuff like that too so if we pack tons of lesson tips and fill with personal example from running you know your or meditations in other words um just set yourself be free from any external uh, objects or subjects so you can sit and see yourself let yourself sink in and see what is it that you need to do for yourself because it's all about yourself first before it's not selfish remember that it's also selfless too because you need to take yourself out unplug yourself in other words you know because we're always in the hustle and bustle world that we need to step back a little bit and see from a different perspective on a similar note i also wanted to share more personal lesson that i have learned while working as my own our own self um recollecting the things that I have gone forth 
you know, through, that we all have gone through as we, in this life trajectory, we have to cultivate the right mindfulness, right concentration, right speech, and right action, right livelihood, right way of doing things. It's just the context that we're able to, uh, to, to have for ourselves without having someone you know tell us all the time because we have been told since we were a kid this is what you should be doing this is what shit this is what you need it's like what about what, what is it that you need to do for yourself so that's something that's also we need to do for ourselves during during those flood of uh, negativities you might feel like everything is falling apart however just know that you are in the right directions you are not trapped you need to tap in so you won't be confused in this time space reality you're not lost in this wandering world because in the world of samsara this heaven gate is open to all those who are willing to have the open-minded. It is the business and relationships for your health. It's business when I say business is not a business term of aspect of business that, you know, make money. Is it business? I mean, it's your business that you need to take in and do it for yourself. And so you can apply for your business in their outer world, in the so-called natural world, uh, the concrete world, the city world, the city, cru city crusader. So the key is that instead of seeing all these problems happening in your life as obstacle, take a moment, step aside, and see from a greater perspective, from the greatness as you are the greatness. Because man, you have no idea what's gonna coming for you, right? Because I was talking to a friend, and you know, this is like when when something you need to let go of because there's something greater that is waiting for you. So we should start seeing this problem as an invitation for more solution for extraordinary things to come into fruition into our life right even though we may not um, see it for what it is I like to say a blessing in disguise from the skies a blessing in disguise from the skies right and as big as they are in the vastness or all in the vast galaxy earth universe it may be coming down on you, the stars, coming down on earth, splash of lightning and the rain pouring, the rainbow are showing, the lights, night, seeing the stars glowing, the tree, it is blossoming, the sun is out shining, even though it's gray sky here in this uh, cougar mountain. <laughs> It is the universe God or whatever it is, the high power that nudge you into something better because there's something that you got to trust within yourself because you got to trust yourself enough to be out here. Trust yourself enough to do what it is that you need to do because today I learned that problem exists not to harm you. Problem exists to support you, to lead you, to guide you to the right, better directions, to, to take you to something greater beyond your expectations, beyond your, your wild imaginations. For me, um, even though I feel like Words cannot describe how I how I try to figure some, some something else sometimes because once I stay here a little bit longer, I may achieve something, something big, some goals. You know, great of, greatest of all is love, baby. In this year, that's what I figure out. Goals is greatest of all is love. Now that's something I achieve. The love, <laughs> or or you may feel lost trying to navigate to to how to lead your your team if you have one, right? But you will establish that when you meet the like-minded like individual to help you, support you for your business to grow, for my business to grow, to our business to grow. You know, there's no there's no loss. There's only to gain and trying to figure out how to stay relevant, right? Or we feel like we're lost. We're not lost. We're wandering and trying to implement our strategy, implement our experience into a new strategy to help our friends, family, our individual, or those who are the mindset that's hurling and you know you've never seen them before when you saw them again this experience that wow we are pretty pretty uh, relatively as like i sign would say <laughs> oh man i know that by seeing this problem or as something inviting as one experience here not on the lane time inviting one experience here not on the time is an invitation and accepting them by we are training ourselves uh, taking that leap of fate of actions towards solving the problem as we're working for our own well-beings to to live a good life 
a better life. We all live in a life. We're striving. We're not surviving. We are, I am here, inherently saying yes to the big opportunity coming our ways, coming my way, coming your ways. Just take that opportunities and just appreciate of it. And so as I share this with you right now, my personal uh, experience, I won't say problem, but there are some breakthrough and there are also the moment where where uh, I appreciate the things that's coming along the way today and it's so far so good and um, I'm looking forward to to share a better, uh, you know, better experience. I hope that you will also choose to see yourself in this, this time, space, reality, situation that you think that you're going through is tough, whatever, you know, you're not, you're not, you're not even, once you break through it, once you break through the struggle with with an, with an attitude of the gratitude that this invitation here that presented to you as one as i mentioned invited one spirit here not not delay in time it's better to happen in your life that is happening for you you know instead of feeling like damn what happened to me for i mean come on things has to happen for a reason right it's not against you things is all working out for you you may hear that every now and then too because it's not happening against you if you are resisting it it's happening for you so you got to work it out for with yourself for yourself for so it can happen up so it can happen for you a little tongue twisted for a second so it is happening so with the gratitude that you are appreciate for that is happening for you i mean why not this is what you want right so you just have to accept the fact that this invitation this this uh this feeling this this view you see here before you you just have to accept the invitation that you view of dreams become less transparent in this emerald world <laughs> emerald cup <laughs> which is saturday so in this emerald world here you see a bunch of tree and leaves and shortly after the beginning of the treatments of becoming increasingly more happy in the difficult times to interpret the the necessarily soon to reach your destination whereas before you couldn't see because you're not open to it so once you open your mind to it you were able to see that the the situation understanding understanding yes understanding is when you lean air when you have the the understanding when you be empty empath you know have to empath empathetic for another person that's when you have more understanding that's when that's where the love is that's that's where the situation as a whole coming to one and you should have you should have to get or something that is you won't you won't have to uh congestions you know and it's a suggestion so you won't be congested and hard to swallow of the thing that is real in our life to bring the dream into reality because we all have dreams but some dreams might be installed to us that's not ours in the first place so whatever your dream is when you start to come to realize it's your dreams keep on working at it because that is where you investigate in yourself for yourself so to speak and save the the accumulation of the money that you have worked for the hard work and if not you can always share the money to go to those who less um fortunate than you are why not i have heard that oh no you don't give your money away they need to work for it yeah i mean if they don't have something you you put the smile on someone's face i believe that something is good for to do i mean it's it's not it's no one else's job to to make them happy but if you put someone a smile on their face just for you just give them you know five ten bucks just that's an expression of you loving unconditionally relational love without even having to want anything back in return no matter if it's two three hundreds who you know it's whatever that's where it's the selfless the sacrifice and how love and kind towards it. all sentient beings come into your practice into your livelihood because the the muddy water by by you in judgment in someone else funny things always with away it will wither away because you are you judge someone without knowing who they are so uh seek first to understand before being understood and knowing a strangely strangely and analysis in either theory or, or whatever it is your hypothesis because you know you don't know them and they don't know you you don't know what people have gone through so be extra nice and kind to, to under to individual for any under circumstances because he dreams she dreams successfully interactions with the dreamers and we all dreams i dreams to have something that is successful as well too the unconscious mind and deep into the subconscious mind that we have been programmed from the conscious mind or maybe unconscious mind because someone else might put in there so if you consciously um 
rewire your mind so you can have something better for the future, right? It's a continuum to trying to understand yourself and also understand others. So if you don't understand other people, you judge them, that's wrong because you yourself don't even understand yourself. You know, it's, it's, hard, it's hard to understand yourself as well too in this world that dreams that has quit because people quit their dreams because obviously it's not their dreams, right? That's why they quit. So whatever your dream is, keep on working towards it because adjust yourself, <laughs> recalibrate your mind, right? And then from day in, day out, you must be on the beginning condition dreams of the latest stage of your treatments of your destinations your beautiful destination consecrations right is your dreams so wake up in the morning with that gratitude or with the attitude of gratitude <laughs> is what i meant and, you know work on yourself work on the arm damn i like that I can see that what meant to happen will happen is a dream connection at least to our point of view for that for that happening for us <laughs> discerning the meaning of the dreams that is is important meaning because it's, it's very important for you to dream and continue dreaming before the dreamers will dreams and dream lot of dreams if you don't have dreams how can you have the dreams come true peace of mind love of heart keep on dreaming dreamers keep on dreaming lovers i free to turn love you